Move over, Kardashians. The Jackson family holds the title for the most interesting family in pop culture history. Even though Michael Jackson has been gone for years, we are still in awe of the absolute weirdness that is the Jackson family. We take a look at 10 things you didn't know about the Jacksons. Number 10, perverted behavior. When you think of Michael Jackson, you probably think of the numerous little boy jokes or the dramatic changes he went through later in his life. But no one really thinks of his rough childhood. As a young boy of just nine, he was exposed to things no nine-year-old should witness. He was part of the Jackson 5 and was often surrounded by the sex, drugs, and rock and roll that Hollywood hits often talk about. His brothers, also famous, would bring girls back to the hotel and have sex in the same bed as him. One can only imagine the thoughts he had laying in bed as his brothers did unspeakable things. Number 9. Staying silent about Michael's changes. As Michael grew to become the star we know and love, he went through some strange alterations. Although his family denied it during his life, many people suspected him of altering his own body. He claimed a case of vitiligo, a skin condition that caused the pigment to lighten. After his death, however, it was revealed in an autopsy that he had gone through multiple plastic surgery operations and had actually used a bleaching agent to whiten his skin. Number 8. The Escape Plan Another somewhat dirty side of Michael was his connection to young boys. Today's teens often crack jokes about the molesty ways of Jackson, but he was never actually found guilty of a crime. He was, however, charged with 14 different counts. 13-year-old Gavin Arvizo claimed he was molested by the King of Pop. Though it was never proven, his family was prepared for the worst. His brother, Germain, had prepped a private jet to carry Michael to safety in the Arab country of Bahrain, where U.S. jurisdiction wouldn't reach. No one knows if they would have actually flown him away, but it was an interesting alternative to jail. Number 7. Jermaine's Jerk Tendencies Jermaine, Michael's brother and co-star in The Jackson 5, was not a super famous man in his later life. He was actually very jealous of Michael's fame and wanted some of it. He tormented Michael for a while and then turned his sights on his other brother's love, Alejandra Oziaza, despite the fact that she and his brother had a couple of young children together. He courted her while his brother was away and eventually married her and had three kids before leaving her just before their 10-year anniversary. Jermaine and his brother were never close again due to the incident. Number 6. Jackson's family had to take a number. As Michael became more and more famous, he became more and more worried about saying something off the record and being recorded. He became extremely paranoid and even forced his family to make appointments to speak with him. His brother at one point became so upset that he crashed his car into Michael's security gate. He was still asked to leave for not having an appointment. The only person exempt from the rule was Michael's mom. Number 5. Some family members think that Michael was murdered. Michael Jackson died of an overdose in June 2009 that was deemed accidental, but was it? Some people think that Michael was murdered by his doctor, Conrad Murray. Even his family thinks that Murray gave Michael too many drugs and caused Michael to suffer the overdose. Harris Jackson, Michael's daughter, even said, quote, he would drop hints about people being out to get him, end quote. Did someone purposely kill MJ? Some people say yes, some say no. We'll just say it's for you to decide. Number four, the shunned Jackson family member. Most of the Jackson family got along all right. Even later in life, they managed to stay active in each other's lives. However, one member of the family was almost completely forgotten. Giovanni Jackson was the secret love child of Joe Jackson and his mistress, who had been with him for 25 years. Joe's wife would often refer to Giovanni as the bastard child and tried to ignore her completely. In 2003, Giovanni met her half-sibling, Michael, at his Neverland mansion, and he was rather cold, even somewhat dismissive of her. He was much more interested in Giovanni's child, Yasmin, though. Number 3. J. 
Jermaine's creepy obsession with his brothers. Michael Jackson was known as the king of pop and a true idol as he matured. He raked in unbelievable amounts of money and fame. His brother, Jermaine, was a very jealous person. And when his brother Michael began to hit his true peak in the 80s and 90s, he began to despise his brother. Jermaine would rant about how he should have been the famous one and he should have all the money. When speaking about Michael, he is polite, but beneath the politeness, there's definitely something more. Number two, she says I am the one, but the kid is not my son. We've all heard Billie Jean, and we can probably all sing the lyrics at the drop of a hat. However, few know the story behind this Jackson song. It is actually based on the true relationship between Jackson and Mickey Howard, or Billy as her friends call her. She was very close to Michael, and when Brandon Howard, Mickey's son, came out saying that Michael was his father, we all assumed that he was just looking for his 15 minutes of fame. Strangely enough, after a DNA test of a dental impression from Michael, it was stated that there was a 99% chance that Brandon was related to Michael. Will we ever know the truth? Number one, a completely loveless marriage. Joe Jackson is known as one of the meanest fathers in the long history of fathers. He would push his children to fame and fortune through beatings and abusive behavior. One can only imagine what it would be like to be married to him. His wife, Catherine Jackson, was extremely unhappy in the marriage and many wonder how she stayed with him for so long. She tried to divorce him twice, the first time when Michael was 15. She was persuaded by her church to stay together for the sake of the children. The second time was after she discovered her husband's mistress. This time she was once again persuaded by an outside source to stay with him. To this day, they remain together, but the reason why is a mystery in itself. If you like this video, why not hit that like button and remember to hit the subscribe button for more videos every two days.